We're here to honor the successes of nearly 200 graduates over the first 10 years of the Drug Treatment Court of Vancouver. It's about standing up, taking responsibility, getting on with your life, with a lot of coordinated support to get past the cycle of drug-driven crime. And it's paying dividends with a reduction in drug-related reoffending rates of over 50%. In turn, it's providing uh, a rebirth for many who've made the commitment and stick with it. For the last 10 years, the court has played a key role in helping to reduce crime associated with drug dependency while providing treatment to those struggling with addiction in our lower mainland communities. This particular drug treatment court benefits from a unique relationship between the governments of Canada and British Columbia, which have provided the funding for the court's work to continue. And that work is getting results. I am so amazed at, at, uh, at how far it's come from when I started. It, it was very uh, grassroots at that point. And today it's just like, uh, it's, I, go, I go back to drug court and I talk to a few of the groups and it's just amazing at the, to, the, to the point because they make you accountable now. It, it means that there was like over 200 lives saved, right? And I'm one of them. So it's just like I would probably be dead or in jail if it wasn't for the drug court program. Really, seriously. So I, I owe them my gratitude and, uh, and I'm just thankful that uh, they're, they're still helping people today. So uh, that's what the drug court's about. In another 10 years, I'd love to be able to come back and see the poster board become a huge backdrop with the names of many, many, many more graduates. Thank you for having me here today. It is inspiring.